Hello Eagles, we survived a couple of Kansas snowstorms, but haven't gotten a snow day yet this winter. It may be cold outside, but the Eagles are burning up the courts and the performance inside this winter. I'm Jasmine and this is your Eagles Perch. Eagleheads competed at the Olathe South Miss Kansas competition over the weekend. Proud Papa Eagle Mr. Herman tweeted, A great job, ladies. We will have results when they come in. Olathe North Choirs performed at the MLK celebration Sunday, January 20th at Mid-America Nazarene University. The North Winds performed This Is Me as a flash mob and a million dreams to close the program. Way to represent Olathe North. With all the great performances by Olathe North students, your Eagles Perch team wondered who inspires you. Our newest correspondent, Sierra, knew exactly who inspires her, her family. She had a chance to interview her sister. Who knew someone you inspire could be so close to you? I asked my sister about different things she liked. Okay. My favorite thing about band is all the people and learning the new music. Something she likes about me. You're funny and you make me laugh all the time. And who inspires her? Uh, um, my mom. This is Sierra, Eagle News, signing off. The Eagles win the Varsity Scholars Bowl Tournament at Marantha January 7th, another example of Eagles performing at their finest. In stiff competition, o Olathe North debate finished third in the Kansas 6A state championship on January 12th. Congratu congratulations, team. <clears throat> Back to inspiration. For some of us, our inspiration comes from outside the family. I talked about Tom Holland and how he was bullied, but now is a part of a very big superhero franchise. I've got some great news. You're going to be Spider-Man. I was like, I know, Kevin. You put it on <laughs> yeah. Instagram. Like, I'm wow. 20. Do you really think I'm not going to find it? We all know Tom Holland plays the role of New York's friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. But what was his life like before landing a role in one of the biggest superhero franchises? I got bullied pretty badly, mainly because if I did my homework, I was called keen and yeah. being good at work wasn't cool. That's right. The 22-year-old was bullied as a child. However, that didn't stop him from following his dreams of performing in musicals to landing big movie roles. In 2012, Holland played the role of Lucas in The Impossible. Most recently, however, he played the role of Spider-Man in the 2017 film Spider-Man Homecoming and 2018's Avengers Infinity War. From a young age, Holland has inspired many people, including myself, to work hard no matter the negativity people throw at you. No matter how much effort it takes, it'll all be worth it in the end. Peter Parker and Ned Leeds are the perfect example of working hard, prevailing through high school, but also being successful amongst their peers, yeah. you know, at the same time. So I think it's a really good thing for kids to see someone they can look up to, but that someone they look up to is a geeky kid, not your typical jock who's the quarterback, you know. What traits make someone inspirational? Uh, what makes someone inspirational is the personality, which by that I mean like, what they do in life. So if they're hard workers, if they're nice to you, if they just seem like overall happy with their life, um, that's usually like someone you want to be or something you want to do. Who inspires you and why? Uh, I have to say my dad and my mom inspire me because you know, like they didn't start from a lot and like my dad has always been a hard worker and he showed me like throughout my whole life how part of a work he is and now I can see it's like results and like everything. What can you do to inspire others? Uh, to inspire others I feel like first of all you should be like yourself and second of all just be a good person so people don't dislike you. Try to like others, be nice, be generous. What traits make someone inspirational? Uh, the ability to motivate someone to like what they want to change or better themselves. Who inspires you and why? Uh, my parents, just because uh, they've worked hard to get me where I am and I appreciate it. And what can you do to inspire others? Uh, just talk to people, get them to change if they want to change. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Jasmine with Eagles News signing off. 
Next up, Eagle Sports News. This is Jasmine signing off. Welcome to Eagle Sports News. Congratulations to the Varsity Eagles Wrestling Team for winning the DeSoto Duels with a 40-28 victory over Tonganoxi in the championship duel on January 18th. The girls basketball first round final in the base attorney, Owen 35, Blue Valley 20. That puts the women at 8-1 record for the season. Their next game was canceled because of weather last week and will be rescheduled. For the Latham North men's basketball team in Chanute last week, and, um, the Eagles won their first two games, 79-58 and 65-52. We have no other finals yet. Stay tuned. Many of us um, have a lot of people to, that inspire us to do better and reach higher. And uh, athletics, our heroes are often on the court or on the field. Both Leo and Brendan share these stories about athletes that inspire them. Future Hall of Famer Dwayne Wade is in his final season of his career. The 12-time All-Star, three-time Finals Champion, 2010 MVP has a, more than a good career. And in the 17 seasons in the NBA, he averages 22.2 points per game, a 29% three-point percentage, and a 49% field goal rate. Out of Marquette with the fifth pick in 2003, he was drafted by the Miami Heat. Playing with LeBron James for more than a decade will teach you something. He started a charity called the Wayne's... Wade's World Foundation in 2009, which promotes education and social skills for children across the country. This is Brennan for Eagle News. This is Leo for Eagle Spirit News, and today I'm going to be talking about Neymar. So Neymar inspires me every day because the way he plays soccer, um, the way that he treats people, he treats people good. He's one of the third best players in the world and he's currently playing on PSG, a France team. So this is Leo for Eagles Perch. This is for ESPN, I'm Elijah, and we're signing off.